radar view. We've got a weather system we'll be watching the next few days. Right now, it's just riding right here along the Pacific Northwest Coast. That system is going to be marching in, and as it does so, especially by Friday and in through Saturday, that will have a dramatic impact on our temperatures, especially heading in to this final weekend of August. Three things snow for your Thursday. Well, it's expected to be another hot day. We'll get that right out of the way. We're not talking warm, very warm. It is going to be downright hot, especially for those of you making it to the century mark this afternoon. Plenty of sunshine, so another day not to forget the sunblock and also staying hydrated, especially if you work outside for a living. Winds will stay pretty light, so we're looking at again not much in the way of that delta breeze to aid in any sort of relief. For today again bright sunny skies filling in across the valley, foothills in the Sierra, and then as we pick up future casts by tomorrow morning, here's when the clouds start to come in with that weather system. A few clouds around much of the northern Sacramento Valley and out towards the northern coast, and then we're pretty much cloud filled by Friday evening, and even a few showers will start to pop up there in the mountains and north of Interstate 80. That will likely take place Friday night and then through Saturday morning. Today, though, a dry, pretty quiet day in the Sierra. Great day to get out to the beach. 83 Lake Tahoe, 80 in Truckee, 90 in Arnold. As you work your way down the hill and across the mother load, 95 in Angels Camp, 93 in Jackson, Placerville, West Point, Railroad Flat Area. Temperatures also in the lower 90s range. We'll top out at 95 in Antioch, 92 in Napa, up through Santa Rosa and Lakeport, 101 in Modesto, 101 in Turlock. And yes, Stockton, you're also going to join that Century Club at 100. Sacramento and areas around the capital city, Land Park, East Sacramento, all the way up into Folsom and El Dorado Hills. Another hot day ahead as we reach 100 degrees. So if your pools are still open, you may be still enjoying those. As the kids get out of school, it is going to be pretty toasty even by noon as temperatures head into the 90s. And by tomorrow, we'll add those clouds in. Temperatures will drop off a little bit, but the bigger impact will be this weekend with mid-80s 